Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. So today we're going to watch and react on the fourth episode of the TV show One Day on Netflix. Um, I'm pretty excited and nervous at the same time because um, this couple is complicated because um, we don't know how this is gonna go because we can see that um, Emma is um, somehow still crushing on him, I guess, and he is like not serious at all with girls. So, yeah. Um, in the previous episode, there was um, uh, not much actions, but um, we saw uh, Emma on um, uh, working on um, in a restaurant that she she doesn't like that job and um dexter is um working as a presenter so they both are doing uh something that they didn't plan um am i still trying to write but uh, she wrote a, pl a play that didn't work and she's basically telling dexter that she wants she might go back to leeds <clears throat> her birth city because it's not working in London he tries to convince her to try again and uh, yeah they left it, each other again and uh, yeah I'm pretty nervous to see what's gonna happen the next one is um, are they going to see each other again um, and um, is she going to try again to write? Is he gonna stay her representator or, you know, he wanted to do photography, so yeah, I'm pretty excited. So let's get to it. <laughs> Again, one year later. Oh, they are in Greece. <coughs> okay. Can you not like all the luggage? Uh, I'll go find us somewhere. You want to wait here? No way, I'm coming. Oh. Can I take that? Yeah. Nope. Okay. <laughs> Right, rule number one, no flirting with me or with anyone else. Oh, that's easy. I don't flirt. Yeah. <laughs> well, there goes rule number two. I'm just sharing the same bed. <laughs> <laughs> what time does the seminar start? Oh, depends. How long will it take you to learn how to read? Ouch. There's that northern charm. So they're like in a holiday together. In fact, I'm thirsty. I still burn. I need cream. Everyone needs cream. I was looking at her. Can I help you? <laughs> You want me to do you back? Come on then. Mm -hmm. Yeah, rule number one, no flirting is going to be hard. <laughs> memories. <coughs> the memories of the first time going back. Excuse me? Hi there. Honey, that bloke off the telly? 
Uh, I, I, I might be. Larging it, isn't it? That's the program you're on. Yeah, 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 that's the one. I knew it. Are you on my TV too? No, I work in a restaurant. <laughs> well, part of the time, as manager. Packing it in soon, though. Training to be a teacher. I uh, will maybe we'll uh, see you lot later then, yeah? Uh, grab a beer or something. Yeah. Mm. Oh my god. What? You appear to be very slightly famous. Has that happened a lot? No. No, that's never happened before, yeah. That was weird. By weird, you mean amazing. What? Oh. oh. Look at you, delighted. I can see it. Shut up. Absolutely bloody delighted. Stop. Stop. Delighted. Stop. <laughs> That's when in the season minus celebrity. Oh. <laughs> it's not going to change you, is it? What? Slight fame. I hate that word. What, slight? <laughs> oh, come on. You've probably never even watched it. Of course I've watched it. And? Well, just tell me what you think. OK, well, I think the programme's a bit like being screamed at for an hour by a drunk with a strobe light. OK, that's fair. What about me? I mean, um, am I any good as a presenter? Yes. Yeah, you're good. You're... You are. You're warm and funny and... I suppose some people might even find you attractive. <laughs> mm. Look! What? Naked! <laughs> Everyone on that beach is naked! Did we? What? Go and join them! Okay. Go over to that beach. <laughs> Uh, alas, we're prevented by rule four. No nudity. It's not a rule, it's a guideline. No, it's a rule. <laughs> well, we've already broken the bed one. So... All the more reason to rigorously enforce the rest. <sighs> Why don't you go... I'll try to turn my eyes away. I just thought we might be more comfortable. More comfortable? No, I don't think I would be more comfortable. Besides, I don't think your girlfriend would be very pleased. But Ingrid wouldn't care. Ingrid, it would not know me. <laughs> of course, there's not much I haven't seen. What's that? I'm just saying. Remember? Red Bull? I closed my eyes, I can still picture it. Mm, oh my god. Yep. Oh, one night of love. <laughs> Oi! There you are. In your nuclear disarmament t shirt. Drunk? Quite drunk. Drunk enough? In fact, I've banked it out. Like a car crash. Mm, liar. Mm. It was a fun night. Come on. You, with your big dreams and your washed out CNA pants. <laughs> <laughs> what? <coughs> you see any pants, you're funny sometimes. Am I? Yeah, every now and then. You should be on TV. Nice <laughs> <laughs> <Where is> you. <laughs> She's keeping herself busy. 
we're trying. Emma, you're so into him. Three. Knew she was still crushing on him, but he's looking at her really weird. Like, I think he's, he wants her to, but not romantically. Or maybe I'm right, I'm not wrong, and he's into her as well. I don't know. Maybe we should just stay here all week. Not island hop, just stay here. Maybe. I think you get bored. Happy then? So what now? Whatever you want. Mm. Scrabble. Now, this was expressly negotiated. Rule five. Was that a rule? I thought it was more of a guideline. Okay, dinner then. I'm starving. Done. Apparently, they have this thing called Greek salad. <laughs> Which is very funny. It's always smoking, like it's either drinking or smoking. No. We might. And in case we do, I had an idea. Let's tell each other something that the other person doesn't know. Like a secret. Like a secret. Just every night for the rest of the holiday. Cool. Okay. Mm -hmm. You first. No, 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 you first. Why me first? Because you've got a bottomless supply to choose from. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hmm. Okay, here it goes. I got off with a guy. I mean, it, it wasn't a big deal. I was off my face, but... Continue. Uh, well, I was on this hardcore night, sex face, in a club called Strap in Vauxhall. Sex face at Strap? Anyway, I was, I was there with Ingrid and some of our mates, and I was dancing, and this guy comes up to me, chaps in a harness, and yeah, he just started kissing me, so I kissed him back. And, um, did you enjoy it? It was all right. I mean, a mouth's just okay. a mouth. Oh, a mouth is just a mouth. Dex, you have the soul of a poet. Well, you know what I mean. What did Ingrid say? She just laughed. She doesn't mind. It's bisexual anyway. <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, of course, of course she is. That's what we're supposed to do at our age, isn't it? Experimenty. Wait. No one tells me anything. Don't give me that. That robot nun routine. You must have got up to stuff. So come on. Your turn. Okay. Yeah, let me think. Go on. After we met at graduation. Before we became, you know, pals. I had a bit of a crush on you. Mm. Well, not a bit of a crush, actually a massive crush for ages. I wrote poetry and everything. Poetry? Yeah, I'm not proud of myself. Well, I'm sorry, Em, but that doesn't count. <laughs> Why not? Yeah. Because you said it had to be something that the other person didn't know. Mm-hmm. You're so annoying. How did you know? Silly told me. Silly. Oh, God, Silly. So what happened to it? This crush. I just suppose it was something you get over in time. Like shingles. Okay. No, really, what happened? I got to know you. And then... George. Ouch. It turns in wood. <laughs> Who's just looking at her? I'm sure she's still crushing on him. And she lied. Because you know he has a girlfriend and he has several girls every time so yeah. Yeah. You're gonna go down to the beach. Left these times tell you that you're breaking up your mind. Night bath. <laughs> right. Yeah, for a swim. I knew it. Turn around. So warm. On him. Before the sun comes up. Are they gonna kiss or something? Like, he's gonna tell her he loves her. He has a crush too. That would be lovely. <laughs> Sorry, soulful face. You're not doing away, are you? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah. Sorry for being a bit dickish in the restaurant. It's alright, I'm used to it. I mean, I felt the same. Wait, what? I didn't write any poetry or anything, but I fancied you. I knew it. I fancy you. Mm. 
Something, Emma. It's just my problem, is that I fancy pretty much everyone. <laughs> Seriously. You can't say that to someone who crush on you. Ready for a relationship? Oh, fuck you. No, I, I think, um... I think we'd want different things. I know. But if you Emma. wanted a bit of fun, no strings, no obligations. Seriously. I just want sex with her. If she's your friend. You can say that to your friend. Oh, Jesus Christ. Of course she would do that. I would too. Well, I didn't draw any of that, you know. Take that as a... I said no thanks! It's weird, you know. How you like to keep me warm. What? It's like you want me to still fancy you. Yeah. Like it's a... necessary condition of the cosmos or something. That I should always just be off to one side somewhere, twinkling away for you. Then I don't think that's true. You're not, though, are you? Twinkling? No. <laughs> yeah, you're fucked up, man. Well, <laughs> I wasn't expecting this. Um, they went to holidays together as friends. And apparently, they both still uh, think about the other and what happened that first night they met, but not in the same way. Emma is crushing on him hard, and Dexter he just wants to have her in his bed, and that's it. I really don't know how this friendship is gonna go because obviously she can't well I couldn't stay friend with someone who who I love and who doesn't love me back. It's it's gonna be hard for her. I guess it's still gonna be friends. But maybe she's gonna move on, and that's why they say 20 years like they move on on each other, they stay friend, but they fall, he falls in love 20 years later. That would be that would be sad, but also romantic. I don't know, anyway. Thank you for watching. Tell me in the comments what you thought about this incredible episode. Um, what you think is gonna happen next. No spoilers again. And um, I will see you very soon for another video. Until then, take care. Bye.